Kiki, President Biden remains isolated at his home in Delaware as the calls for him to drop out of the 2024 race are growing. Two Massachusetts congressmen find themselves tonight in the middle of this debate about the future of the White House. The Biden campaign vowing the president will stay in the race, forcing many Democrats in Congress to go on the record. I am not in any uh, sense of panic or sense of urgency to uh, to fracture the party. Massachusetts Congressman Jake Auchincloss urging patience after a fellow member of the state delegation, Congressman Seth Moulton, who considers President Biden a mentor, wrote an op-ed in the Boston Globe calling on the president to pull out of the race, saying the 81-year-old barely recognized him when they met at a D-Day memorial event in France last month. Moulton writing, quote, it was a crushing realization, and not because a person I care about had a rough night, but because everything is riding on Biden's ability to beat Donald Trump in November. America needs him to win, and, like most Americans, I'm no longer confident that he can. The president should bow out of the race. Moulton using the story to push other lawmakers to come forward, writing, quote, We have a choice to make. To my colleagues who are deeply concerned but who haven't said so publicly, let's demonstrate the courageous, forward-looking leadership that Americans tell us they want in their politics and rob the Trump-Vance ticket of the opponent they want. Privately, CNN sources claim Biden is beginning to take concerns of many in his party into greater consideration as Republicans appear more united around former President Donald Trump. Those concerns also being heard right here in Massachusetts. I'm hearing deep and unaddressed doubts about the president's ability to beat Donald Trump, about his ability to discharge the duties of his office over the next four years. Uh, but I'm also hearing that my constituents recognize it's his decision. While it is Biden's decision, more than 30 Democratic lawmakers are now calling on him to make it and get out of the race. In the newsroom, Stephen Quinn, 7 News 19.